Hi gamers, Neil here. I'm back with another crew review video for One Piece Straw Hat Chase Voyage Chronicles. In this video, I'm going to review Crocus. I'm going to review this hero's skill set, give you guys some recommendations for Haki, runes, team formations, and more. At the end of this video, I will give this hero a rating based on my play experience. Also, if you are interested in tier lists for this game, links in the description. First, some background story for Crocus. Dr. Crocus was a lighthouse keeper. As a doctor, he served three years as part of Roger D. Gold's crew. In this game, Dr. Crocus is a dedicated healer support. His first skill, Sedative, heals all friendly units and grants them a damage reduction buff for two terms. His third skill, Herb, revives a fallen hero or heal one unit if no one died. His passive heals a friendly unit with low SHP upon his basic attack. Based on Dr. Crocker's skills, his every skill heals makes him a super healer support. In terms of Haki and runes for a healer like Crocus, you either get those ones, those attributes enhances Crocus' healing skills such as extra healing, cleansing, or advanced purge, or you use those ones to increase Crocus' survivability such as Revival, X-Revival, HP Region, Dodge, or even Damage Reduction. It all depends on your playstyle. My recommendation is to mix them up, enhance healing ability on main Haki, and use Survival Attributed Runes. In terms of team formation, I recommend you to put Crocus at rare where most support sits. Dr. Crocus works extremely well with a self-healing tank like Marco. Not to mention they are emperor heroes. You get a team buff for having them on the same team. So in conclusion, I give Dr. Crocus 8 out of 10. He should be a 9 as one of the best healer in the game. But as an Emperor hero, he is very hard to get. But nevertheless, he is an amazing support. Rank him up and he will keep your team alive for many battles to come. Ok guys, that concludes today's video. As always, please leave your questions in the comments below. Take care and uh, thanks for watching.